Why need a Bynum say God told her to tell the congregation to give $1,077? And in addition to that, she told five other people to give $5,077 to receive a blessing from the Lord. Watch this. Some of you, I'm calling you to give 1077 Yes, Lord. He said, and there's five of you. I'm calling you to give $5,077. When you get through doing it, I want you to take your phone or take your hand and tap your, tap your screen because you got to touch and agree with the altar that's in this house, but you've never seen what God is getting ready to do. First of all, let's do the math. Five times $5,077 equals $25,385, not including the $1,077. Make it make sense. And let's put this in perspective. Even though God is not speaking through Juanita Bynum, there is nowhere in the Bible where God charged his people to speak his word to them. According to Juanita Bynum's doctrine, Jesus is not the same Jesus that he was in the Bible. Because in the Bible, he healed people for free. But notice, according to Juanita Bynum, you have to give her money. And then Juanita Bynum says, take your phone and place it on the altar. To come into agreement with the altar. Nothing she's saying relates to the word of God. She makes it all up to appear to be as closer to God than everyone else. Coming into agreement with this altar she's talking about does not change the fact that she's lying. Because God does not charge to bless his people. This is another Juanita Bynum scam. To trick people out of their money. Your money cannot buy a miracle. But it can buy Juanita Bynum a mansion. Matter of fact, this is what separates Jesus from the occult. See, occultists charge money to divine. So if someone tell you you have to pay money to them before God can bless you, they are not prophesying through the Holy Spirit. The reality is they are divining. And they are using manipulation, which is a characteristic of witchcraft. This is why false prophets and prophetess like Juanita Bynum, they always focus on people's problems first. That's a common tactic all false prophets use. And they do it to manipulate people through their emotions. And once they put the hook in people, then they pretend to be prophesying in the name of Jesus. Now, here's the catch. In order to be delivered from your problems now, you have to give Juanita Bynum your money. So make sure you're not moving in your emotions. Because if you're not careful, you'll throw all your money away to these false teachers. God bless you.